Hi Linfield, my name is Jaylee and I'm a senior. Welcome back to Inside the Pride, a video series where we give you an inside look on some of the amazing things that we do here at our school. I know it's hard to believe, but graduation is just around the corner. And for some, this not only marks the end of our high school years, but also the completion of a 13 year long journey. One that we started as tiny kindergartners back in the fall of 2010. Linfield calls us the lifers, and we have been extremely blessed to be a part of this community for as long as we can remember. This has truly been a gift, and recently we got together to exchange some fun memories and to reflect on how this experience has affected our lives. Check out this video to see what happened. We're all connected here as a community and it's been fun like growing up with the teachers and these classmates but it's also cool to see like some of the teachers like come out to like your games so like Coach Pine I've seen him at some of my games and also at the boys varsity games and it's a really cool experience it was a nice thing to see him come out and support. I'm grateful for the community here at Linfield, not just in my own campus here at the high school, but across all three campuses. Um, as a senior, we get to do a glory project, and my group decided to go down to the elementary school to do a kindness initiative with the second graders, and I got to build connections with them. And when we were going down today to film, one of them came up to me and was just telling me that she was having a rough day and that she was thinking about me a lot. And when I was in elementary school, I always looked up to high schoolers and I always wanted to be just like them. And when I came up here, I didn't really think that I was going to make an impact on anybody younger than me or even my own peers. And so that kind of reassured me that I was doing something right. And I think that shows just the amazing community that Linfield builds here um, with students and their peers and students and their teachers. And it's really a family here and that's something that I've always valued and I felt safe to be myself. Well, I have to say that this group is one of my most special groups that I remember teaching eighth grade. They were, by, I think, four years in, and I think what I remember most about them is that they were super creative, super fun, and we had, I don't know what it was about our connection, um, but it was definitely something special because they still are the group that comes across the bridge to say hello and visit. I've also taught a lot of their siblings, so that's really important to me because that's what Linfield is to me, is family and those connections. One of my favorite um, middle school memories was the DC trip. I remember just like, how excited all of us were, like as a class to go to New York and Washington DC. Uh, the thing I remember most about middle school is just always being in Mr. Underwood's office. I was always getting in trouble for something, uh, but I am grateful for it because he kind of just straightened me up and made me into the person I am today, making better decisions later on. The thing that I'm most grateful for in the 13 years I've been here is definitely the friends that I've made. Um, I've made some, some long-lasting bonds that I'm, I'm really confident that I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep well into my adult years. Um, I'm just really happy with the, with the connections I've been able to make. And me personally, like one of the most important parts of my like, Linfield career started here. It was I, I started band. And uh, with all with like you guys, yeah. Also. yeah. <laughs> we all started band in uh, elementary school, and we're still all in it today. And I thought that was just that's just like one of, like one of the bigger parts of like my career at Linfield, I guess. And yeah. I feel like it'll carry through to college to me through or two. And uh, yeah, I just really enjoyed that part. Yeah, the fact that um, 
like starting band in elementary school. It's made music a part of my life, whether Absolutely. whether I continue to play my instrument into <coughs> college or not. Uh, the fact that I started it here is like it's made it like one of the most important things in my life. Yeah. Yeah. Um, when I think back at my 13 years at Linfield, I think the thing that I'm most grateful for is just the relationships that I've made here because I know that I can, even after high school, after we graduate, I can come to any of these people here at Linfield and just the community that we have here is just so amazing and I'm so grateful for it. Uh, I would say in general all the teachers are great. Uh, I can always ask questions, go in for extra help and they're always there for me. So. <laughs> Um, having a relationship with all of our teachers just makes it easier for us to know that there's always somebody there to talk to. There's a lot of teachers that I can talk to any day, like Mrs. Alexander or Marla or Blades, um, Della Rosa. <laughs> yeah, so very cool. <laughs> Mine are the same ones. So. <laughs> Linfield has really prepared me through all these years, even from elementary, middle school, and high school, but especially the biomedical program. When I was in eighth grade choosing my classes, TJ really encouraged me to take his class. He said it'd be super fun. I was already hesitant, but I said, you know what, let's do it. So then I took the first semester and I did really bad. <laughs> I wasn't really able to dig deep academically, I had a lot of going on. But then TJ said just to stick it out the rest of the year and that you'll just love it. And he ended up being right. I, actually, I absolutely loved it and that has really prepared me to be like a nurse and it's just been great. Um, and it's just really nice to know that we'll always have a place to come back to when we visit our family and everything and even the people, all, all of our friends and all the faculty and staff will be able to visit them too as well and it's like we're never actually gone, <laughs> we're still here. Thank you for everything, Linfield. That's it for now, but we'll see you next time. Thank you for joining us on Inside the Pride. Go Lions!